All right, thank you, Dan. Uh, joining me now is Dana Simons from the Wabash Valley Recovery Alliance. She's here to tell us about a new event, the Blackout Addiction 5K. You brought along some props. I did. And, I, and I'm, you know, Blackout Edition, that means this is not being held at noon, is it? No, it's actually being held on Friday night, the 13th. Friday the 13th? Friday the 13th. Oh, my gosh. You can go scare everybody with your blackout, with your glow paint and yeah. your glow sticks. And, well, that's fantastic. Um, so, yeah. uh, first of all, tell us a little bit about the your your organization, what it is. Um, Wabash, Valley, Wabash Valley Recovery Alliance is a new alliance of people that are involved with addiction and recovery. Mm -hmm. So it's all the treatment providers, the recovery houses, people that are in recovery, peer coaches, family members that have been affected by addiction. Mm -hmm. It's an alliance of everybody coming together. We think we're stronger together rather than trying to work, work it at this problem separately. So we're coming together. We're actually opening a new center, a, a Wabash Valley Recovery wow. Center right okay. downtown, which will be a kind of a one-stop place for anybody who either wants help or wants their family members to get help and they don't know where to go. They can go in, stop in there, have coffee with a coach or be pointed in the right direction. Uh, now, if I re remember correctly, you've been involved with this kind of um, help yeah. for a long time. How, how satisfied are you to see this, everybody coming together? It's wonderful. So I, I'm the executive director of the Next Step Foundation. Right. We provide housing and programs in Farrington's Grove. Um, and it's just great to see all of our, our fellow uh, housing providers, Truman House and Club Soda and all the different providers, Harsha and Hamilton, all of us coming together to work together instead of staying in our own little areas. And, and, and th it should produce some results, shouldn't it? It should. Yeah. That's well, this event, let's, let's get into it right now. Okay. Uh, so it's the first time you've ever done this. Uh, it is. It, and what do you expect? Well, what we expect, we already have, uh, the word is out among the recovery community. Okay. So a lot of people are coming to have some sober fun okay. uh, with their kids. Kids yeah. are free. Uh, it is a fundraiser for the Wabash Valley Recovery Alliance for the center, and so it is $25 for adults. Mm -hmm. um, and what we're expecting is a lot of fun. We we'll have a bunch of um, out, uh, visitors that are speakers that are coming from out of state, from Kentucky and from Texas, mm -hmm. and a whole bunch of musicians. So there's also going to be a concert as we're waiting for it to get dark. So Name it starts, a couple of those uh, groups. Do you remember all uh, Cloud Gang and Colici and... and I can't remember the rest of them. But There's a whole bunch of them. You said they're popular among they're those popular. in the recovery community. Yeah, they're very popular. Okay. And we're bringing them in from out of state, from Texas. And All so right. it should be a really fun concert, a really fun time. There's going to be food trucks there. We have a whole section for the kids. We're calling it the Kid Zone. So games for them and paint. And there's lots of paint where you put it's, it on and then it glows. It really sounds like a wonderful event and first time out of the blocks. It's at Fairbanks Park. All right, Dana, thank you so much. The Blackout Addiction 5K will take place on September 13th. It's Friday the 13th. So what? This is a good time <laughs> to celebrate. 6.30 p.m. at Fairbanks Park in Terre Haute. To sign up or learn more about the Blackout Addiction 5K, it's on uh, race.com. Mm -hmm. Check that out. All right, Dana, All right. good luck. Thank you. Have Appreciate fun. it, Mike.